All right, our limited equipment option is gonna start out with an 800 meter run. It's your choice how hard you run this. If you're feeling good and running is your thing, warm up and push the pace on this run and see if you can get a nice 800 meter time trial in. Now, if you're someone who struggles with running and um, you, know, it's, you wanna just kind of focus on trying to complete that 800 meters without having to walk or having minimal time to walk. And if 800 meters just sounds like a huge task, then focus on jogging nonstop for say four to five minutes, okay, total. Now, once we finish this, we have 30 seconds at each position. So it's gonna be 30 seconds of kettlebell swings, 30 seconds of no push-up burpees, followed by 30 seconds of kettlebell or dumbbell push press. That can either be with two dumbbells or it could be with a single and you'll go 15 seconds on one side, 15 seconds on the other. We'll rest 90 seconds and we'll do this five times. The first move we're gonna go over is going to be the kettlebell swing. So here we have the hips, gonna drive the hips, finishing tall, pressing that kettlebell straight to the sky. Okay, it's really thinking about drive the hip and then pull and push overhead, keeping that nice and quick. Immediate transition to the next movement, dropping it down. It's gonna be getting the plank and then back up, standing tall, moving as quick as you can for those 30 seconds, okay, or as quick as you think you can repeat, repeat, and then we're going into those dumbbell push press. And again, if we have two dumbbells, we're gonna keep them pointed straight ahead, just quick pop, quick pop, quick pop. And if we have only one dumbbell, it's just gonna be 15 seconds on one side, switch sides, and then 15 seconds on the other. Now, this workout being essentially 90 seconds of work with 90 seconds of rest, focus on trying to repeat the number of reps you've got each round, okay? So push the pace, but don't go so hard that you can't repeat it. All right, focus on that good quality range of motion and moving steady. And we hope you enjoy this one. Get after it.